I look like Janice Ian. No? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jenny, and if you're new here, welcome. I do bookish and gaming content, cozy hobbies, if you will. In previous videos, I've talked about my no buy year and how I'm trying not to buy anything. She's in this size, she can't decide. Ugh, my lips are dry, girl. I've been posting updates on my no buy year on my TikTok. For those of you that have been asking for updates, I was just testing out their new feature of posting like long form content because you know TikTok is trying to take over YouTube, right? And if you're not aware, now you are. They're trying to take over. YouTube is still like my heart and soul. I've made YouTube videos since I was literally 14. Hey YouTube, I'm not trying to be super awesome booktuber. Um, anyways, my no by year has caused me to reflect on some things, especially because one of my goals is to beat all the games that I already own. And as you can tell by the title, these are the games that I regret buying for my Nintendo Switch. Which a lot of people I think had the same opinion. Bratz flaunt your fashion. It is a classic Bratz game. If you love the Bratz, it's nostalgic. You dress them up, you do social media contests, all this cute stuff. Little quests, you could beat the game in about four hours if you really just sit there and play it. But I bought it on release day for $40 and that is not the vibe. Definitely a $20 game, maybe less, but $39.99, honey. <laughs> And I can tell you now, I've never beat the game. I played for three hours, got bored. I will be picking it up again. I will be beating it this year because that's the goal, to beat everything that I've played. But the next one is a little bit interesting. It is Cooking Mama Cookstar. I had no idea that this game was discontinued because supposedly, allegedly, when you would put the cartridge into your Nintendo Switch, it had some like firmware in it that would cause the, Ninten the Nintendo Switch to overheat, burn out, and die. <laughs> I don't know, there's a lot of rumors out there, but the game was discontinued, taken off shelves, which is probably the reason why I found it for $20 on Amazon. I've played twice, found out that information. I love my Switch, okay? And I don't wanna do anything to damage my Switch. Cooking Mama is also an app and it's available on Apple Arcade and I have my Apple Arcade subscription and I could have just played through there, but I wanted to have my grubby little hands on the physical copy. Stardew Valley. I regret paying $20 for Stardew Valley on the Nintendo Switch, not only because I later found out that it sucks on the Nintendo Switch, but I also didn't like it. Okay, I probably didn't like it because I played on the Nintendo Switch and it sucked on the Nintendo Switch, let's be honest. I regret it. I regret it. I have downloaded it and removed it completely from my Nintendo Switch three times because I've given it three chances and I hate it. I know that's an unpopular opinion. Maybe one day I'll play on the PC or Xbox and give it a different chance. As of now, not for me, sorry. The last game that I regret, Mario Party. I didn't know that Mario Party Superstars was gonna come out. So I bought Mario Party, the Nintendo Switch one. It's up there. Now nah, I can't see in the dark. <laughs> I can't read that from here. So if you're gonna invest in a Mario Party game, which I highly recommend you get a Mario Party game because it is so fun to play with other people, get Mario Party Superstars. It has all of the Mario Parties that we know and love in one game, in one game. You can ask your friends, what's the Mario Party level that you remember and you wanna play? and you can pull that one up and play the different boards from all the Mario Party games. Now I have this Mario Party that I never play. The fucking point. I have the best one. I have the best one. It has all of them on it. So that was two games that are like $60 and I only play one. If you take anything from this video, it's that you should buy Mario Party Superstars. What are some of the games that you guys regret paying full price for? I wanna know. If you watch this video all the way, leave a cloud emoji and stay beautiful. I love you. Peace. Thank you.